Pretty excited because I just got my big fish transferred down to the farm. Got a gar I caught last week, a bunch of big Oscars, and big Dum Dum over there, the Paku. Um, yeah, so it's all dechlorinated. I'm going to turn on the sump pump for um, aeration. And all the all of a sudden, the fish will disappear. Check this out. That's going to be good flow there. Kind of hard to do with one hand. Ready? Set, go. I think they're going to be happy. I got to cover it so raccoons don't eat them. All right. Do they all look happy? I think it's 500 gallons. I don't know. 500? Yeah, why not? And then there's java moss, some carpet moss, some form of sprite. But I think I finally have a colony started of cherry shrimp underneath there somewhere. So that'll be the first. This will be my first section of the colony, and then I'll start breaking it out into different colonies. We're gonna make a farm, so. Alright. So this is my first attempt at mystery snails. Um, but so I moved the three mystery snails back from the uh, bucket that's outside to uh, inside uh, this aquarium, the ram aquarium. And then I dropped the water level a little bit. And then that night, this female with that exact thing. And so I have it sitting on some sponge just to keep it moist. And yeah. Let's see if we can get all the occupants in here. I really want to get some pistos. We lost the uh, male German blue ram. He got an infection. Is that a, oh, there's a little ghost shrimp. But there's our female, German blue ram. She's looking awesome. So yeah. Oh, and I started, uh, I started uh, setting up this, this sectional. Okay, I got, this tank has been cycling for about three days now. This section has been cycling. Might need a little bit more media. Um, I took the sand and seeded it with the sand from that aquarium. Um, and then this one, it just has movement. I'm just cycling them. And this will eventually be the quarantine tank. I don't have any new fish, so there's really no point. And since I don't have anything to put in this one yet, this will probably serve as my quarantine tank. Just bare bottom until I need to utilize it. But all right, this is gonna be fun. Local wildlife aquarium thing. Got a bunch of big guys. Look at that gar. This is my hand, and this is probably what goes back. Eight feet, six, eight feet. What is this? A big cat, man. Channel cat. This is how you're That albino girl is really It's like a very happy catfish. Big cat. Man, this is where we can donate our big fish if, if they ever get to that point. Oh, this guy's cool. 
This guy's super dope. It's like a calico. Or maybe that was a disease or something. Maybe he just got hurt. Maybe that's why they turned the albino. These are some big dudes, man. He's probably scared of them. That's massive. Mm. He's just kind of a funny guy. He's huge. Big as cars. That is freaking nuts, dude. We're gonna go look at this side now. We're gonna go on this side now. More little drawers. This is cool. I kind of like how they set up this aquarium. I might do that with bamboo. Set up the walls and just like make a forest. That'd be super cool. I'm gonna have to take our pocket here when it gets too big. 